Here in Miami, the first thing you think of is defense. And they're led by a group of linebackers that are the most experienced, disruptive, and vicious in the nation. The used linebackers play together. They play so fast in manner, they violate. Shaq Quarterman, Mike Pinckney, Zach McLeod, as a group, how would you describe their impact on the field? Pinckney is a prototypical Will. He's got such a great instinct for the game. Maybe the best player I've ever coached in terms of having great intelligence in terms of his preparation. Shaq Quarterman is a tough of a player as, as anyone I've ever coached. And Zach McLeod is sort of the secret assassin. As nice of a kid as I've ever seen off the field and on the field, maybe the hardest hitting kid we've had in this program the last four years. It's all three guys are different. Zach, Mike, Shaq, uh, I appreciate you guys being here. Let's take a look at some plays. Mostly, I'm laughing like crazy when I'm watching you guys play football because of the things you do to your opponents. Now, here's you, Zach. The center is going to pull around, going to block you. He's this big old massive offensive lineman. You're this little bitty linebacker, right? A little bitty. I don't know about it. He's got you covered up. But look what happens next. How do you get from this position oh, you to see this the position? Over. You see the arm over right there, huh? That's technique, baby. I was trying to get my hand anywhere on his chest after I got brought it over and keep my outside arm free. That's the, that's the main thing that was keeping my outside arm free. And Surratt, though, is going to be flipped over. That's kind of vicious. All that's right. some WWE type stuff. He runs up field, so I have to come out of coverage. I'm the first responder coming from outside in. I couldn't get my near toe up how I wanted to, but I'm going to win the end of the play regardless. And that, in any way we could be physical, we're going to make it happen. Uh, you guys, it's fun to watch pictures of hitting. You know what we should do now? What's that? Let's go down to the field. Let's actually do some hitting. What do you think? Well, I'm with that. The big hit. And that is a huge play for Miami. What makes a hard hit in football for you guys? What do you do? OK, so if you're coming, if you're yeah. coming towards me, I have my shoulder picked out, whatever shoulder that is. Yeah. I'm going to come from this side, because that's where the ball's at right now. Yeah. And I'm going to get low, and I'm just going to put it into it. I'm going to put my shoulder right there. Or depending on who you are, if you're a blocker, I can put my face mask right up under your chin. That's how you bless them. And if I hit somebody and we stalemate, you got to go backwards. If you're not going backwards, it's not, it's not a good tactic. OK, how are you going to do that? But you got to grab that right here. That's when you get that uneasy feeling. They feel that, uh -huh. you lift up. Uh -huh. You, I feel you get nervous right now. That's I'm, what happens. You get I'm nervous. extremely nervous. And then you pick that up, and then you dump them. And then you get up, you get up slow, and you tell them to try again next play. And then you do it all, all game. Get the turnover chain ready. Well, they've been seeing that chain a lot lately. The most visible thing nationally, symbol for the Miami defense, is the turnover chain. How much does it mean to you guys to get one of those and wear that on the sideline? It means everything to me. It means I'm a game changer. Point, point blank, you're a game changer. You change the title of the game. You either bringing your team back, separating even further, or you're stumping the team to death with a turnover. You've been starting together as a group since your true freshman season. You could have gone to the league, you stayed. Why did you stay? The season didn't end on how we wanted to end on. And uh, I feel like we didn't we didn't do anything to leave our mark on this, this school and uh, college football, you know, so. Just another opportunity just to leave out the younger guys and set that standard. And there's only one thing that it's about at the end of the day here, right? It's all about this. It's all about to you. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.